Last month, the educational testing service began using a new TOEFL. TOEFL is the widely used test of English as a foreign language. It already measures the ability to read, write, and understand English. The new test does more to bring these skills together and also measures speaking ability. The TOEFL examination is used by more than five thousand colleges and universities around the world. About five hundred fifty thousand people took the test last year. American schools generally require it. For foreign students seeking admission, ETS officials said the new test better measures how well students are able to communicate in English. Skills in reading, writing, listening, and speaking are tested in combination. There are questions where test takers must read, listen. And then speak their answers, or just listen and speak, or read, listen, and then write their answers to the question. The students speak into a microphone. Three to six examiners will listen to the recorded answers. Experts have long said that one of the major required abilities. A attending college in the United States is speaking English well. Many times, foreign students have earned high scores on the TOEFL, but have had problems at school because they could not speak in class. The new test is called TOEFL IBT or Internet Based Test. ETS officials said it is the first major test of English to be given over the internet. Students have already taken the new TOEFL at testing center in the United States. It will be given on October twenty second in Canada, France, Germany, and Italy. It will come into use in testing center. And other parts of the world next year. ETS officials said they expect the new test to change how English is taught around the world. News reports said many Asian students are worried about the new test. Their English teachers prepare them mainly to read and write, not speak. Companies are already offering preparation materials for the internet-based TOEFL. Educational testing service offers a free practice test on its TOEFL website. The address is ets.org-toefl. This VOA special English education report. Was written by Nancy Stenbox. Our reports can be 